time to start <coughs> the weird zoo. Okay? Just opened. So you guys get to see it for the first time ever. Oh, and you get to see me do this. There. So. Notice the temperature right now. It's 8 o'clock in the morning on February 1st. And it's 102 degrees outside. Okay? This is where you came from. This is the terrain of the place where you are right now. Okay, so we're in a scorching hot desert. Alright. Got a feeling this is not going to be a very popular zoo. You walk in, first thing you see is these weird topiaries and then a Christmas tree fully decorated. Oops, whoa, went way too far there. Hang on. Ignore that. <laughs> Alright, so, first thing you see is a weird Christmas tree with some panda statues, or polar bear statues. So, kind of weird already. There's two ways to go. It doesn't really matter so much which way you go, but I'll go each way. First one, you go through the acacia forest. Then you cross over, or you cut through the neat little topiary thing going on. And you come to this, where the temperature is currently negative 4 degrees. So mind you, it was 104 a minute ago, and now it's negative 4. And there's three different cave tunnels you can take. Okay? And just to show you, the other pathway was this... Other pathway has two hat stores, so that people can buy hats. A nice little waterfall and a little pond, which probably is nice in this 150 degree or 104. A weird little overhang thing, and an underground tunnel, which I'll take you through now and then take you back again. It takes you to this train. So yeah, that's going to come into play. Arr! Navigating through these tunnels is a pain in the butt. Alright, back to the waterfall. Cool. So first we're going to look at this one. Go through the tunnel. There's something on the other end. I wonder what it is. Whoa, it's like the Amazon rainforest. Whoa, it's be is that a reindeer? Since when were there reindeer in the Amazon? Is that an Arctic wolf napping in the Amazon rainforest? Oh, this is so weird. I wonder if there's anything in the water. What are those? Gray seal? But they usually live in the north. Oh my gosh, and what's that? Oh, that's a pile of poo. We got gray seals, reindeer, Arctic wolves, and... Bison in the rainforest? Now, naturally, I'm zooming through this part. Wouldn't be seen where you see that it's the desertiness. I'm hoping. So, the idea of the uh, effect that it'll bring is the animals will start coming up closer. And then you'll be sitting there watching this through the glass, you know, because you're at a zoo in your nice little cave room. And there's a bison in the rainforest? the hell? So yeah, now we move on through. I achieved baby boom. 
Oh, because all my baby, all my animals are having babies, which is another thing I set it so that it'll do. Also, there's not predation or any. The animals cannot get hurt in any way, and they won't be affected by the fact that they, you know, are not supposed to be in such temperatures or stuff like that. Now the middle path, where these people are all leaving. It's the beach on an ocean? But what are those animals? We got lions and pronghorns and camels and orangutans? What are they doing on the ocean? Those sorts of animals aren't even usually on the same continent as each other. This is so weird. Where's the male lion? Oh, there he is. It's weird that nobody's swimming. <laughs> Might have made it so they can swim. I'll have to check into that. Okay, there's some... Oh. What's down this way? That's the employee's only path. And we flew out of the sky. Next up. Go down the third path, which is darker, kind of spooky. They're running away from whatever's going on here, so... Oh boy. What is this? Oh wow. That's beautiful. And it looks like Letchworth. But wait, what's in here? Is that a Garial? Okay, let's go back to this. Those aren't native in North American uh, temperate forests. That's so weird. Wait, what is that? A Galapagos tortoise? My gosh! And there's rhinos, hyenas, and flamingos, and a couple baby flamingos. Hey, baby flamingos. Whoa, this place is crazy. So yeah, it looks like just Canada or Letchworth or anywhere. But yeah. I got there. See, you're looking at what looks like Canada or Letchworth. And there's an ostrich. Just hanging out. Oh, it's raining. Oh. Last thing I'd ever expect. Oh, and a cheetah. I forgot that I had a cheetah in here. Oh, the animals will come running into the rainy area. Or the nature. Or the. the forest when it's rainy. Oh, that'll work out nice. I'm gonna go. Ooh, the rain makes it nice out though. It's only set, it's set, it's a nice cool 75 now. Let's go see if that changed the uh, first one we looked at. Yep. Or no, this is the that's the uh, jungly one. By the jungle, I mean the beach. Let's go see the rainforest when it rains. <laughs> oh no, I'm still not seeing anything. Alrighty. Well, let's do this.
Now, unlike my other rides, we're actually gonna ride the train thing. And since we're human, we get to cut the line. train ride. We just in a steamy tunnel, basically, because there's nowhere for the uh, smoke from your train to escape. You can't see anything, it's just darkness. speed of this train. <laughs> Cinematic camera showing us all the exciting action of this train ride. This is what it would look like if you were under the train. So typically during this train ride you'd have a person on there t telling you facts like, I'm, uh, you might not know it from your experience here, but, um, Arctic Wolves have are not native to the uh, Amazon rainforest, and I've never seen a cheetah at Letchworth State Park. But here, you'll see those things. And what? Oh, we're going up a hill. Don't worry, we won't ride back. So, um, also, you know, we were at the, we saw at the beach, there aren't usually, uh, camels in the ocean. They're not an aquatic creature. Neither are lions or orangutans. All of those are tropical or even arid creatures, like the camel lives in the desert, or the lions live in the savannah, or... You know, those, they don't, they don't live on the beach. So if you were to see that in the wild, it's weird. So be confused. Oh God, this is slow. All right, we're leaving now. We're exiting the cave. To the left are some trees, and in front of us is a bunch of... Are those pyramids? What? Okay. Open. Alright. So then you get out of the train, 
Oh wait, am I at the other one? I think I'm at the wrong spot. I think it's, yeah, it brought me back to the... So the train goes over all the bubble land. And it ends up... Why is it moving so slow? I don't think my computer likes me traveling this distance. Alright, so... Okay, I guess we're going to the desert first. Alright. Here's where you get out of the train. Pump, pump. Now you can go straight ahead, where... You get to see... A nice... Sonoran Desert. Like, this is like the desert you'll see, you'd see in, like, Arizona. Let's see what sort of animals are native to the Arizona Desert. We've got penguins, flamingos, and saltwater crocodiles. All creatures you'd expect to see in the desert of North America. Next up, go through some more caves. Oh, got some more shops. And then what's this? Oh, it looks like a nice little garden in Japan or China or kangaroos. There aren't kangaroos in China. What's th is that a... That's a polar bear! Swimming around here! And what's that little guy? What is that little guy? Oh my god, it's a baby warthog! Oh, baby warthogs! But yeah, there's warthogs in here, too. I love you, baby warthog. And giraffes. So, yeah. In China, there are giraffes, warthogs, polar bears, and kangaroos and then off to the sixth and final exhibit the African savanna famously home to doll sheep red pandas snow leopards and is that a dead snow leopard oh, it's a sleeping snow leopard but it oh no and otters Yes, otters, the famous natives to the African savanna. Oh, and apparently a couple seals. Why are there seals? Oh, well. So, yeah. There's Spooky Park. Just for fun, let's make it snow in the desert. show you guys what I wanted to have happen in the Letchworth. Is this or is this rainforest? This is rainforest, isn't it? Oh, man. Well, there's a site you don't see every day. The Amazon rainforest covered in snow. Man, these people are really happy to be walking in this 
negative four degree cold there with the snow. Ooh, is this popular? Well, looks like the Letchworth exhibit's popular. Uh, <laughs> some ostriches running around in the snow. Some cheetahs. Yep. This is a weird world we live in. Hope you guys liked Weird Land.